Erickson Experience Center in Plano, Texas, and the North American headquarters for Erickson. This is one of five experience centers globally. Our goal is to show off how people use the networks and what might be coming in the near future. We are leading the transition through mobility in that network society as well as the back-end networks to communicate. Ericsson is one of the largest telecommunication equipment providers in the world. Right now, if you make a call on a cell phone anywhere in the world, over 50% of the time, we are part of the network that was built into that system. We have a very wonderful architecture that's very uh, modern design as far as the color of the feel. It's a very open facility. When you walk through it, you feel like it's a nice place to work. The outside view is spectacular. We have a lake that we can look at. Some of the things that we like to show off is our TV and media solutions. We like to show off a lot of what Ericsson's doing in TV and media. Recently, we've made some big moves toward gaining uh, market space in that location. We also show off quite a bit of information on what we're doing for the future of connectivity. So 5G, we showed off just a little outside, we have the 5G network. In here, we show off how you use it. So we have a connection to a remote digging unit that you put on an Oculus headset and be able to remotely place yourself in that location and drive it real time. We build everything from uh, sites that blend into shopping malls so that it looks like a clock tower or something like that to even we've partnered with Philips to develop outdoor lighting systems that cities can deploy and then lease out the space in them to put radios in or the operators can deploy and provide it back to the city. We're showing off a lot of the information we're basing our cloud architecture on, whether that is our, our architecture that uses the HDS 8000 or whether that's using the solutions that we integrate into that with our partners and our own capability. This is really built completely for a customer attendance location. We can strip this up to focus on what the customer is interested in and broadly show off all the areas of interest for that customer. Ericsson is an interesting blend of cultures. Um, from the Swedish, very pragmatic, everyone wants to collaborate. So Ericsson is highly collaborative and it's very much open top organization, meaning they're very low architecture to the company. You can go in and speak to anyone at any time. Ideas are allowed to grow uh, with you and you are allowed to drive how you want to take your career. What Ericsson's looking for is imagination and drive along with the skill set understood in ICT. So really a lot of the ICT back in is where the future we see moving. Today's episode is brought to you by Telecom Careers, the number one global telecom and wireless job board, telecomcareers.net.